welcome to successful trading for this uh, daily market recap uh, literally folks the market just closed um less than five minutes away i wanted to, to, to get this one in it's going to be a short video because uh the the the, the summary of the day was put pay better Yes, that's the quote from our trader of the week, a rookie trader of the week, please, from Singapore, who has just been crushing it after a week with us at Successful Trading. She has been studying like crazy, and I can tell you, we cannot wait. We talked about it in yesterday's video. So today, she crushed dates on um, on trade that we took all took at uh, at the end uh, the, the 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 session yesterday uh, on financial and I pretty much that was the pattern today. We have several traders on here. Can we flash that screen here very quickly? In uh, of a subscriber who just went well, you 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 know it, folks. I, I'm not ten baggers. Yes, that that that's what it is. So in this case, buying Wells Fargo puts for ten cents and uh, selling them. At a dollar and four. That's uh, that's 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 what we do. Another trader here, Mr. Pity himself, <laughs> he got six cents and he sold them for more than a thousand percent for seventy cents. So that's the type of action that has been going on. But let's really go into the detail on why the setup was were, were, were led to that. So here we can share with you very quickly. So let me bring uh, the fifteen minute chart on here. That's where we're comparing side by side on the spy. Okay, folks. This this is this is this is this is a picture perfect. So, this action on here on spy, right? So this is the chart of spy, and this is the chart of the option of. I, I picked the three hundred put because I don't know how many hours into the session I'm exchanging in our chat room and uh, with one one of the trader and. Um, uh, I just told her, you know, 300 is coming, right? So the entire time, as this thing is taking its time, 308, we were just updating. Okay, spy 308. And then we share this picture uh, in, 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 our, in our chat room because this was in the perfect channel. A lot of stocks, actually, I'm going to show you a lot of stock. When you see a pattern like that, they, they were following it. One of them that I can't think of is NVIDIA. But my friend, this is the parabolic move. This year is telling you that. Uh, yeah, the reason you see this change, if you caught that before my eyes, let, let, let's let's maybe wait for a couple of seconds to see it change again. Because, as you know, or you do not, you may not know, SPY and the ETF they trade 15 up to 15 minutes after the session. So right now, that they are still trading, and that's something that you can do. You can take advantage of that. I'm just giving it that technique to 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 to, to, to some folks. Hey, you can get feels after the regular market has closed in that 15 minute that sometimes actually uh, is, is a trick so the question will be tomorrow what that will happen right so yeah just uh, as to close on here so these puts my friend yeah puts pay better <laughs> that's the course of the day <laughs> straight from singapore uh they 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 they, they pay four thousand seven hundred percent it's a this is not a calculation or anything that's that's what is there so meaning if you were able to get those put folks that that's the type of day that uh, we have had and because of this action where we got down from 320 to 310 or three we what's the was the open on here so let me remove this to to, to read that for you and there was some sideways action at the time. I just told the traders that I wasn't buying this uptrend of movement. And uh, some of them who were wise onto it, uh, <laughs> it was time to get out of uh, out of uh, uh, the calls because certain stock like uh, this one, they were trying to stage a, a rally. I think definitely there's money to be made here. There's, there's an easy 50 or 100 percent to be made here, but uh, maybe this one didn't move that. Except it's here for the end. So. Uh, we traded uh, the we traded the 87 puts on on here. They they paid they paid they paid well for us. They paid after the they, we got in after this candle just before the break on here because of this rejection on here. We've talked about technical analysis and this is something that we do teach you at successful trading. The goal of our um, channel of our blog is to teach all of this teaching is inside the articles that we have for free for you so when you come and, and schedule coaching session because it's different for everybody instead of going one by yourself into learning something it's good maybe you feel more comfortable when somebody actually show you the ropes that's what we do in our coaching and you can set up uh, your, your a meeting with us or from, from the website successfultrading.com and when you come 
yeah, I have traders that so this coming Saturday, yeah, we will be sitting down and teaching ABC of technical analysis. Some traders do not need that, so they are comfortable just getting into setup, trying to um, look for pattern, doing quantitative analysis. That's another thing that we teach, or we, we can uh, educate you about so flow algo uh, uh, as well. So all of those things, if you are looking for a place to trade, uh, we think that successful trading is a place for you. And uh, do not just be absorbed by what you see in the videos because we have to report the performance. I cannot hide that or anything. So, but uh, the joke that I have about uh, the 10, the 10 bagger channel or anything, well, yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's much for not even marketing or anything. It's just an inside joke that we have as we explained in one of our recent uh, blog, blog articles. So, uh, What's in store for, for the market? That's very interesting because very quickly on here, oh, here's another stock that had a pattern that is similar to Spike. So let, let's look at it in the 15 minute. Yeah, this is the channel. This is that channel. So this one actually, um, we, we still have that position open and we believe, we believe, I mean, I want to be wrong. It wouldn't be the first time, right? So from here, something's going to give tomorrow. I mean, 3.30 puts, anybody interested? Do we remember? After the scandal, what happened the next day uh, on the 26th, on the 27th? So that's what we will be looking for. Um, if it materializes, hey, if it doesn't materialize, we have enough gain this week to leave for uh, another, another week. So what the overall picture of the market seems to have changed today just with a snap. Let's take a look at the daily for QQQ, well, first spy QQQ and IWM or IWM. Yeah, I, sorry, maybe I'm the one who, who, who called that on IWM because in yesterday's video, if you guys remember, there was an overly text saying that IWM rally is complicated, the struggle continues. Okay, I don't know about you guys, but this candle here, straight up into the teeth of the exponential moving average 20, this is not looking good, folks. This is not looking good for bulls right now. Uh, some, I mean, tomorrow we could gap up, obviously, and have a nice green candle. Life is back to normal and everything. But the logical thing from here will be a candle such as this one where we come and test low the, or, or other lows. We, we, that's, we are not there yet. We are just, just showing you this thing to keep them in perspective. But something has changed. So um, it will be interesting. One of our traders mentioned something um, in, in, in the Discord room. Let me bring that to you so that, uh, yeah, I can do that. We, we don't have anything to hide on here. Uh, well, we have a lot of things to hide, but uh, <laughs> no, 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 that part. They, okay, there was mention of this, okay? Massive prints from uh, the, this Japan ETF. So from uh, JP Morgan, last time that happened, uh, Pity is, is the trader who brought us this, this information. So that's mid-February. Uh, that, that, that's, that's, that, that's a characteristic that happened. For me, what I, uh, I haven't verified that yet, but here's what I can tell you. When I'm looking at this chart here, okay, we have seen that before. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah this, is, this, is, this is it. Looks like it, right? The beginning of something big. Yeah, so it will be interesting to, to do some type of research. And I think I've seen a candle like that way back somewhere here. No, that was in July. Uh, it, w it was another year where, and uh, it was part of Flow Algo where they actually used that. Yeah, uh, w w w that, was that here? I think it was some, somewhere here uh, uh, as well. So when these things happen, major moves starting, that, that's the time to pay attention. Meaning that right now, yeah, of course, we're going to wait for confirmation of anything, but let's not be surprised if tomorrow or Monday we come in and there's a huge gap down or, or, of anything. You heard, you, heard, you heard that one on here. The one that definitely we will be looking for is this one, right? It's at support. So what, what happens tomorrow? Do we go and test lower as we did on here? Because it has this tendency, right? Big red candle. The next day is another big candle that test low so we are exactly right here so either we recoup or we do what so this this is what i'm talking about here 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 can i highlight them if if i knew how to draw maybe i would have a chance but I, obviously i do not 
that's fine. You, 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 you get the picture of what we are trying to illustrate. So we will, tomorrow's session will be interesting. Then we go on the, the two day weekend. Monday session is going to be so much happening in the market right now. So yeah, in just a span of one day, we are now back below the all time high of 237. Who would have thought it? We were trading at 240, over 247 yesterday. We are 234 today. And last but not least, IWM on here. Ooh, wow. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's easier to look at it in, retros in retrospect, right? So Monday morning quarterback in to say, oh, geez, that was easy. You just have to follow the trend. But yesterday for us, we were talking about it here to think that, oh, a pullback uh, back to, to, to 140 uh, is a healthy pullback or anything. My friend, this thing did more than that. The options, they paid just like anything. Any option chart that you open today going to show you major major i mean some stock didn't move that much uh, I, I i can concede that to you but look at some of these payouts five thousand percent six thousand percent so and this is off the back of nasdaq hitting uh ten thousand for the first time so folks we are in store for a great session tomorrow so we hope that uh, you will come with us please if you like the content of this channel subscribe share with your friends in social media and we will continue to cater the content of this channel to your liking good night good morning good afternoon wherever you're watching from bye bye